What's cracking, fam? We are back with another video. We are here. Doing this one. Waiting for door. It's been on waiting for door for about five minutes now. Okay. Let me go pull my bill away since we're waiting for them to bring our freight. Okay, I see they're pretty big. Easily two pallet sizes. ¿Pesada? Getting the pro stickers. Gracias. Right, guys another beautiful day another beautiful morning well afternoon we are starting off with a I'm assuming it's a full load so right now we're gonna get a high queue which is the height of the trailer since the freight that we're picking up is gonna be double stacked I don't know how tall they're gonna be so
Everything's good. I'm already hooked up. I did the tug. I already checked under it. Guys, whenever you guys get a container or a rail, always make sure that the latch is in, not out. Make sure that the pins are out. Some containers may have four, two on each side. This one only has two, which is just this one and the one on the other side. And more importantly, check the locks. Always make sure that it's not like that. And if it is, make sure you lock it up like that. Because if not, these two, you end up carrying this while this ends up on somebody's car. So you don't want that. Both sides. All right, guys, we're ready to go. Look at whoever was driving this tractor either last night or yesterday, they put DEF or DEF and didn't put the lid back man these guys but anyways we're hooked up we're ready to go let's go get this money man all right guys we are here we are at uh at uh at uh, at, uh, at, uh, at, uh, at, uh, at uh, yamaha all right guys we are here we are at yamaha we gotta go check in to see what door they're gonna give us. And then we gotta come back, open the, the trailer doors and back it in. Normally they'll give us dock A through F, one of them. They'll be like, oh, park on whatever dock. But let's go check it out. Pretty windy today and cold. There's nobody is all dark in there. Come on. Yes. Okay. Alright, so I got the green light. A or B? I heard A, B. So that means A or B. Thank you, bro. All right, let's go open the doors and back this thing up.
guys, we made it. Here they come. And it's windy. It's windy car. So this is going to be one of the bikes, but it's going to be a truckload. And they're going to go double stack like that. Man, it's chilly, bro. Man. Yamaha. We normally do similar stuff at a city of industry at a place called what is it called? What is it called? Um, Suzuki. Suzuki. Same concept. Truck load. Nothing but bikes. But today we're here at Yamaha. Oh man, I can't stand this cold. Ooh. Let me go check if they have the bills ready. At least. Man, the lady's way the hell over there. She's like in a hole. She's in her section. You know what I'm gonna do? Cause I think they're still not done with my order. So if that's, yeah, cause it says UP, UPSF. That's uh, UPS Freight, which was us. So if they're not done, I'm just gonna go to the truck and grab my sweater cause it's cold out here. Habla español? Sí. Va a ser toda línea. ¿Toda esta? El total van a ser 16 piezas. Oh, ok. Solo que ahorita esta no tiene ley, por lo menos tiene que tener ley. Oh, ok. Sixteen, yeah. So I guess that's it. That's not gonna be a truck load then. The only thing I hate about this place, Yamaha and Suzuki, is that the bills stack like this big to sign. That's the only thing I don't like. Other than that, I mean, it's cool, you know. Just one big stop, pretty much. You know what? I'm gonna go grab my sweater. Ooh, it's freezing. Ahí está. Oh, okay. Okay. Entonces nomás va a ser esto, ¿ah? Sí, nomás esto. No, no, no va a haber más. Por el momento nomás esto. Ah, ok. Cuando termine cargado, yo entrego esto y le hablo para que venga a tomar los pilas. Ok, gracias. Alright guys, back to eating. I forgot my sweater, or should I say my windbreaker? Cause I was eating. I was eating some anchovies and the guy called me to sign some paper. So I pretty much got out the truck for getting my sweater. But he's gonna load me up right now anyway, so. He said he'll call me when it's done. So yeah guys, so I don't know about you guys, but I like wild white anchovies in extra virgin olive oil. Or water, doesn't matter. I mean, I just, in general, I like anchovies and sardines so when i'm out and about like right now this is what i snack on so i don't snack on chips i don't snack on bread i don't snack on on none of that none of that bs we in that healthy lifestyle up in here i'll get back at you when i'm done hi right, guys they're done let's go sign them bills damn i forgot my jacket again Ugh. Yes, sir. So I got half the trailer still. Let's check how much space I have. So I got 14 spaces. 14. ¿Voy con la señora? No, todavía no. ¿Todavía no? Tengo que hacer un procedimiento aquí. ¿Ustedes el de Chifo, no? Sí. Ese ya está nomás. Ok. Ok, you're going to put your carrier, signature, and date on all the pages. Okay. One hour later. Hi, Pat. Okay. Thank you. Is todo? Okay, thank you. All right, guys, we are done. We got the bills. And now, since we got 14 faces, we're probably like not even half full. Man, it's chilly, bruh. 
That is chilly, bro. Ah. All right, guys. So right now we're going to hit up dispatch and see what else they want us to do. So I'll get back at you when I get more info. Hey. Guys, we pulled out from the dock. Now it's time to go lock it up, close the doors, and I haven't called dispatch yet. Man, can you guys hear me with this wind? Man, it's hella windy and cold. So yeah, we got the freight right there. Not much. Chiquillo mio. And, uh, anyway, uh, I have 14 yeah. pallet spaces. You want me to do anything else or head back in? 14. Yeah. Uno cuatro. Oh, yeah. Oh, the white? Para que me entiendas. I have I haven't counted them. You want me to count them? Yeah, eh? yeah it's a little stack. There are some 16 pallets que me dieron. How many? 16 bikes. How's it going, man? I'm calling from T Force. Um, yeah, I'm calling from T Force. Do you guys have 13 pallets? Uh, uh, yeah. Okay, we'll ask for Carla. Okay, thank you. All right, Carla, All right, Simon, I got it. 10-4. All right. Yeah, I sent it to license. Okay, sounds good. All right, and that's it, guys. We got a pickup for 13 skids. That's going to leave me with one space, one pallet. So let's get to it. Let's get to it, my boy. My boy. Let's roll. I normally be throwing these things out the window, but not today. We got a trash can. We found a trash can. And we're here. Got to go back in. Parking on door nine. Do they want us there? I don't know. We'll find out though. Or 13. We do the snake. If y'all know what the snake is, we do the snake and then we back up.
my damn pro stickers, yo, and my boot, yo. Yo, I don't got pro books, bro. Damn. Hopefully they're already pro Hi. Are you here to pick up? Yes. How many pallets? 13. 13? Okay. Uh, Viene a recoger las 13 paletas. ¿En qué puerta? Yeah, I'm already backed up. Are you already backed up? Mm -hmm. You're good to go. Don't oh. worry about it. Okay. Right okay. Do you need a seal? No. Oh, no. Right. no. We're supposed to pick them up uh, Friday, no? Someone came yesterday to pick them up. Yes. Oh, okay, okay yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, yesterday was Tuesday. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yesterday someone came, but it was after hours. There was someone here. Mm. Oh, okay. All right, and that's it, huh? Yeah, that's it. That's it. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Have a nice one. So, do we go over there, or do we just? You could just wait in your truck, and then that's how you want to pull up, and then you pull up. Ah, perfect. Thank you. All right, guys, we are done. Well, with this one, we started at noon. We're barely four hours in, so we still got a pretty long time to go. We get loaded. Man, it smells so bad over here because waste management is right there and all the stench is coming over here. Ugh. But anywho, yeah, we're done. We're four hours in. We got to do at least nine, ten hours. So we'll head back and grab another assignment and continue on with the with the rest of the day. All right, guys, we're done. So, wait, what the? F dude did not load me up, dude. He loaded the wrong fucking trailer. What a f idiot! He loaded that blue container instead of me. Yo, what the? F this dude is an idiot. <laughs> wow. Wait, unless there was a change of plans. Let me go back there. Dude, what the hell? That's a trip. These guys are so in a rush to get out, to be done for the day, bro, that they rushed me because I was taking my 15 minute break. Hold on, guys. I'm blindsiding this. B. I don't even know if they're going to want to load me up right now. That's what they get, bro. That's what they get for being in a rush. They did not load me up. And now they're going to have to come back and load me up. Which that's going to waste more of their time. We have a problem. Yes, go ahead. Okay, we have we got I have the bill, right? Yeah. But I don't have the freight. Yes. I thought that my guys let you know. Um they won't be able to load you up because not all thirteen pallets fit. Mm. So therefore I called the customer and the customer said to take all panels out mm. and that they will reschedule for a pickup for when they can pick up. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That's what happened. I thought they let you know. I, I had told no. them to let you know. Well well he well he weighed me down. He was like uh, I don't know what he was doing. Maybe he was trying to do that. <laughs> but I was like all right, cool. All right, like, so gonna... I'm pulling out and I'm like, all right, then I'm, I'm closing the door and I'm close the first door. And then I kind of like glance inside. I'm like, okay, you know, I'm, we're done. And then yeah. I'm like, wait, that's what I picked up before I got here. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Yeah. So then that's why I'm like, yeah. okay, so we're good. Yeah. So they, they didn't load anything mm. because it doesn't all fit. And the broker decided to just remove everything. And therefore, someone else. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Thing. Yeah, because I, I heard movement on the other trailer next to me. Uh -huh. And I'm like, oh my god, don't tell me these guys loaded the, the other trailer. No, 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 yeah. no, 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 definitely. Oh, okay, so we're good. All right, so do you need this or? No, I, I can throw it away for you. Okay, okay, Thank Perfect. you, though. Thank you for checking in. All right, thank, thank you. Ah, oh, that smell, bro. 
It smells nasty. But anywho, well that guy instead of calling me over, he just said he was just waving like if he was done. So it turns out that he was supposed to tell me that the freight wasn't gonna fit, so they didn't load me up, and that was it. Rescheduled for the next day. So I guess I guess he didn't mess up on the on the freight. <gasps> so so yeah, guys. I guess this pickup is gonna get picked up tomorrow. I guess. But anywho, guys. So yeah, guys. Back to the yard, and let's see what's next. Running and got the motherfucking plug. Alright guys, we are back. We are back at the yard. We're about to back this thing up to the dock. We just have to open the doors. So when I was on my way over here, we got a message, a group message for all the drivers. And it said this. We'll take a screenshot and post it. Yeah, you guys read right. I was like, what? Probably like five hours in. So the thing is, we are guaranteed our hours, our eight hours. But the thing is, if there's no more work driving, you can complete your hours by working the dock. Most of us drivers really don't like that, you know? We're drivers for a reason. We ain't no dock workers. But if we have to, then I guess we'll do it, you know? But it kind of sucks when it's kind of this slow and you get hit with a message like that. Especially starting at noon, you know, there's a greater chance of you not being able to get your eight hours compared to coming in at, at eight. So I know you guys want to see me back up. This is, I mean, I'm wide open, so it ain't no biggie. You know what's so funny is that every time you back into a dock in between trailers you back it in like nothing right but when it's wide open there's like five doors open and you try to back it up into one although you have all the space in the world you tend to do more pull-ups and backups than when you're backing it in in between two trailers i don't know about you guys but that's happened to me a lot and i noticed that too i'm like all right two trailers all right like nothing and then here, there's like six, like seven doors open all together. And I did like three or four pull-ups. It's crazy. And I catch myself doing the same thing all the time. Let me go check in and see what we have in store, man. If not, that'll be it. <laughs> 